Hi, Charlie. Hey, Mrs. Jefferson. Oh, uh, let me have a ginger ale. Uh-oh. Tough day, huh? No, just a typical day married to George. <laughs> In that case, let me uh, make it a double, huh? <laughs> <laughs> really nice to see you, Mrs. Jefferson. See, I got this problem, and I'd really love to discuss it with somebody. It's uh, about the bar. You know, your husband has been bugging me lately to uh, book in some private parties to uh, help increase business. Well, I finally did it. Hmm? What's the problem? Well, it looks like I'm going to have to close down for a few days. See, uh, my aunt died, and I got to go to Florida for the funeral. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah, I hate Florida. <laughs> No, I mean about your aunt. Oh, yeah, that too. <laughs> Charlie, if you have to go to the funeral, all you've got to do is find somebody to work the bar. Yeah. Hm. Well, now, let me see. Where can you find someone you know? Ralph the doorman. <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't work at night. Mr. Bentley. Who doesn't have an accent. Mr. Willis. Who has a financial interest in the business. My wife. <laughs> Who talks to you. That's it, I'm stumped. How about me, Charlie? <laughs> well, Mrs. Jefferson, you don't really want to serve drinks to a bunch of old skulls. Now, that's not a nice thing to say about your customers. No, 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 Mrs. Jefferson, see, that's the private party I booked in here on Friday. The Skulls. They're a motorcycle gang. <laughs> a motorcycle gang? Yeah. Uh, like Hell's Angels on wheels? More like uh, Hell's Accountants and Carpools. <laughs> see, this is a reunion. I mean, these guys haven't been bikers in 25 years. I mean, today they're lawyers, uh, doctors, hairdressers. Hairdressers? Well, I didn't say they were a tough gang. <laughs> what do you say? When do I start? How about right away? See, they're uh, burying my aunt at sea, and I figure if I get there early, I might be able to bag me a tuna. <laughs> I'm sure your aunt would have wanted it that way. Yeah. Oh, now, Mrs. Jefferson, it's real simple. See, now, if we uh, run out of olives, you just add more olives. Run out of cherries, add more cherries. Run out of limes. More limes. You're a natural. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, why don't I run back there and make out a list of things for you to do, all right? Okay, Charlie. Thanks. Excuse me, where's Charlie? Oh, he's in the back. Oh, this problem I had, I wanted to talk to him about. Oh, well, may I help? You? Well, why not? Maybe I should get a woman's point of view. You see, I have this terrific job, a great wife and two wonderful kids. Well, that doesn't sound much like a problem to me. Well, the problem is my girlfriend. She wants to, uh, she wants to be with me more than two nights a week and every other Christmas. You think that's fair? I mean, after all, I got a lot of responsibilities. Fair? Yeah. You have a wife and two children. And you want to know if two nights a week with some bimbo is fair? Uh, in a nutshell, yeah. What do you think? <laughs> that's what I think. <coughs> you know, that's exactly what my wife said. <laughs> Thank you. 